We're in the air studio right now with Mojo Mix. Hey, here we are. Do you guys want to introduce yourselves? Sure. I'm Dean Monroe, Mojo Man Dean. I'm the leader of the band, guitar player, singer. Over on my left here, which you guys can't see, but I'll tell you, on my left here is a harmonica (laughs) player, Dennis Tully on harmonica. And we got Chris Weinriss on the stand-up bass, and Matt Howlin' Wolf back there on the drums back there. So uh, that's oh. the band, and uh, real pleasure to be here today playing. Make sure you guys pledge music like this. Local music's really important to support in this town. So really, I encourage you guys to to call up and or go to the website and pledge your support. We got to keep the local music scene going, and uh, that's all I can say about that right now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> all right, how about we go into a song? All right. All right, here we go.
Mojo Mix in the studio right now, and I'm going to take a wild guess and say that was called Mojo Man. Yeah, it was the one we wrote, or actually I wrote about uh, five years ago. Five years ago? Mm-hmm. I'm guessing your band has been together then for quite quite some time. Actually, no. Uh, uh, I just got together just this uh, year, last uh, probably five months or so. Uh, Dennis, my harp player, I was working, uh, I got uh, in an accident, a pretty bad car accident a few years back, and I was kind of paralyzed on my left side and thought I had to give up music uh, for good, and I was kind of sitting in a music store, kind of working there, and uh, Dennis came over and, and found me, and he knew me from the old days. I used to play a lot of shows, and the big shows on the big stages. And he just started bringing his harmonica over on Sunday afternoons, and, and that was kind of my therapy to because I couldn't even use my left hand that much. And little by little, I could play 10 minutes and then 15 minutes. And after a while, I got up to an hour. And uh, once I got up to two hours, I said, well, I think I'm ready to go back out and play some music, you know. And so we got together, and then Chris came on board. Thank God, he's one of the best bass players around in this town that I know of. The plays stand up and regular bass, and and then Matt Matt on drums just came on board, and I'm sure lucky got him too. So all of a sudden we got a band, and we're playing at <laughs> Severino's on Tuesday nights, and uh, playing the Aptos Barbecue and Mission Street Barbecue, and um, just having some fun, you know. That's what it's all about. It is what it's all about. What does being local mean to you, and what's so important to you about really being local and supporting that scene? Well, I'll tell you, local mu- music in general is just so important in our culture, I think. Uh, and being local, every area has its own flavors and influences. And, and Santa Cruz is a really unique area, Santa Cruz County and the Bay Area here. And at one time, it was uh, when I lived here back in the 60s and 70s, it was all musicians in this area because, you know, rents were like 100 bucks a month, you know, for <laughs> houses and stuff. So it was Musician City as well as that artists. That happened? Yeah, it actually <laughs> happened before Silicon Valley, you know. And so it was a great place for musicians to come and, and get together. And uh, a lot of good music that comes out of this area as well as comes into this area. We're here with Mojo Mix. And let's get back to another song. All right. Well, here's another original that I wrote when I was in in my 20s hanging out at the boardwalk. <laughs> Yeah, man. 
Girl. <laughs> <laughs> Bebop girl. How do you how do you go about writing your music? Do you write it as a collective? Do the lyrics come first? Does the music come first? Um, I, I pretty much right now the songs uh, I do are written by me as uh, as far as verses and, and words and and basic melody. But uh, since we're so young, I'm just bringing what I already have to the table as far as the band being together only for a few months. But as we go forward, we will collaborate more and, and do some more originals probably as a band too. But uh, yeah, these are what I bring to the table right now and uh, I'm lucky enough to have them join in and make it sound good. What are your other future plans for the band? Well, we are local. We do pride living in this area and, and glad that we can live in the Santa Cruz County area and by the Monterey Bay. And I can't think of a better place. I've lived in Hawaii and New York City, but I still call this home. So, uh, you know, I want to play around here and uh, hopefully more venues uh, will, you know, we kind of want to play the, the venues that that, that complement our kind of music and, uh, and work for us. And uh, we feel like we can pick and choose and... Uh, and just get the music out there, and uh, hopefully um, things like having some radio coverage like this will get the word out a little more that we're available. And You can go to a Facebook page, Mojo Mix Blues Band, if you want on the Facebook, or um, you know, you can check us out at Severino's. Keep your eye on the Good Times grid on Tuesday nights or just in general and see where Mojo Mix is playing. Mojo Mix. All right, yeah. Well, I'd like to play. This is uh, kind of featuring the chromatic harmonica, which is a different kind of harmonica. It's an instrumental, and also will feature Dennis Tully and uh, Chris Weinrich on bass. This one's called Very Greasy. One, two, one,
Why you love? 
banjo mix here in the studio. Wow. <clears throat> Playing the blues wow. for you, ladies and gentlemen. Playing the blues. Call up and show your support. That's right. That song got me in the feels. Oh, good, good, good. <laughs> You know, some songs just really capture your spirit, and that was one of them. That was amazing. How long have you been performing and playing that song? Well, uh, ever since the band got together, it's one, two, one, two, three, four. <laughs>
Mojo Mix. Thank you, thank you, thank, thank you for having you us for coming in today. It was a pleasure to have you. Wow, you sound amazing. You have a couple shows coming up in Aptos, but we can find you on. Uh, well, we're yeah, you can at uh, Facebook.